The Rhino Cup is here so that we can raise funds for the Rhino Conservancy and uh, ESCDT, the East Africa Character Development Trust, and uh, it's been awesome so far. People from all over the world pre-COVID would come here, teams to co compete for the Last Man Stands Rhino Cup and the Sudan Smash. One is a serious tournament with competitive players and one is very much a social thing for people who want to support the charity because it's a fundraising event. Uh, my expectations were exceeded because uh, every day I learn something new, I meet new people and this is something that I, it was unheard of when I was growing up. We have a mixture of all different nationalities and communities that have contributed to coming here to play. Kids from our program. Some of them have never been out of Nairobi before. They're now here at this weekend in a game park. I mean, that's a life-changing experience in itself. We use the teaching of the game of cricket as the conduit, the mechanism by which to change character and, and uh, teach character development. Uh, as I grew up, uh, Despite of me being a quiet kid and uh, a shy person, this helped me to speak up and to come out of that comfort zone. I started with gratitude, and that is my favorite character up till now. Uh, if a person would uh, do something, even if it's small, I'll come and uh, appreciate him. Dennis took to what we were doing very quickly, began to love the cricket, saw an opportunity of becoming a good player, took on board the character traits and development, life skills, things that we do, and in a word, cut a long story short, it transformed him and he's developed into a fantastic young guy and he has a real talent for filmmaking and, and um, media stuff. East Africa Character Development Trust aims to change the lives of thousands of African kids to give them hope for future. East Africa, Character Development Trust, Rhino Cup champion 2022. Big round of applause, everyone.